Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Well, today I'm going to show you guys how I seal the weft of my Virgin Peruvian hair that I got a while ago. And I actually did a video of um, my show and tell showing this hair and everything. So you can check it out if you want. And um, yeah, I just want to show you guys how I seal the weft. So I'm going to seal the weft of this hair. And you can, as you can see, there's no beard in it. So sealing the weft is going to make it a lot easier. I don't really like hair with like any hair with like... Um, Bears on them and all them kind of stuff. I don't really like it because then it, the hair gets tangled inside the beard. So I hate bears on my hair. So when I got this, I was so happy to see that there wasn't any bears in it. So that's one of my most have when I'm buying any virgin hair. So um, I'm going to show you how I seal the weft. I never sealed the weft of any hair before. So this is my first time. And this is my 18 inches right here that I'm going to seal. And I already sealed my 16 inches. Let me show you how it is so I sealed the weft of this already so I just finished sealing now as you can see so um, I sealed both sides but I haven't sealed the top yet I want to seal it later on because it's a bit it's a bit wet so I still have to leave it for another 30 minutes before I seal the top so that's one of the weft done already so and uh, let me just show you guys how I seal this so I'm just get it open and start. So still in the weft actually helps it like um reduce shedding or reduce any um any like any shedding in the hair or any hair coming out. It just helps um, helps the hair like last longer. So that's why I decided to seal my weft. So um, I'm gonna seal the front, the back. And then I'm gonna seal the top as well. And I'm using a fab fabric tack. That's the one that I'm using. And I got this from my local store near where I live. And yeah, so that's what I'm using to seal the wefts. So you can get this anywhere actually. I was searching on eBay. They have um fabric tack as well on eBay, and they have and this website called Hair 101. I think Hair Extension 101. You can get um um, weft sealer as well in that website but this is fabric tack that I'm using right here to seal the weft so it just helps it um, like stay, the hair like I, I'm gonna seal it to make it like stay longer and everything and then it gets hard the top of it starts getting hard and everything like that but when you're sewing it in your hair you're gonna go over it like that so you won't be going inside the weft anyway so it's good to seal the weft it's just last longer I want the hair to last long so that's the reason that I'm doing this and this is my first time ever doing this kind of thing, so I decided to just film it. Okay, so the thing you only need is this, the um, fabric tack and a comb, just to comb bow. So one of the things that you have to not get, um, one of the problem when I was doing the first hair that I had was the hair kept on going inside the hair, this hair right here, some of it kept on going inside the weft and that was quite annoying so you have to make sure none of the hair comes in. I was trying to put something on top but then you guys won't see it like, you guys won't see what I was doing so I decided just to do it this way. So this is the body wave hair, you can see the waves. Okay so let's get started with this. So I just go over it like that. If I hope you guys can see that. Yes, yeah, so I just go over it. I do this just once. So I go over it. I'm just praying no hair comes into the wife because I don't like that.
okay now I just finished one side and it has like this clear color if you guys can see it there let me just show you it has like this clear color to it so it's a bit sticky just trying to show you guys so yeah I finished one side of it and I'm gonna let that dry and I'm gonna come back okay so while my 18 inches are drying out my 16 inches which I did earlier on because I was practicing I'm going to show you guys how I do the top side because I only did the front and the back but I haven't done the top like the top of the web like up here so I'm going to show you guys how it is and don't mind the color and all this kind of stuff it's going to fade out um, as time goes on so it will be okay so I just want to show you guys how I seal the webs of the top side so let me just show you so I just go over it like that the same way but just on top It might be getting a bit messy, but it will be okay. As long as you, your, your hair doesn't shed, you'll be all good. making sure I get every single part of the top because that's the important bit so and the weft sitter just soaks in soaks into the wefts I'm just bringing it closer like this way because I want you guys to see how I do it properly So I've just finished doing the top, the top weft, and that's how it looks. So I just finished doing the top part, as you guys can see. So I'm just gonna let this dry, and I'm gonna try my my twenty. Okay, well now it's five hours later and I finished sealing three of my wefts and it took me like five hours to do this because I had to do one side and then wait 30 minutes and do another side 30 minutes and I had to do the top wait 30 minutes for each and every one of these um, weaves right here. So that's all I had to do so that's why it took so long and yes yeah, so that's what you, that, that's what I did and when you're doing this um, sealing the weft, the three things you have to look out for is making sure the hairs don't get stuck in the weft because if they do get stuck they like get tangled with the weft and everything like that and then the the uh, fabric tack gets um, tangled together with the hairs and then it's very hard to come, come out and they just have to pull it out and then you you um you start getting like broken hairs so I'll show you the hairs that I got from doing this sealing the weft thing I got that that's the uh, fabric tack there and that's all the hair that I got from from all this hair right here. This is all I got. So that's not even really like because the hair is the hair is shedding or anything like that. It's just because of the fabric tag got together with the hair and then you have to pull it out because it's very sticky. The next thing you have to make sure is making sure it doesn't get really messy. Making sure everything is one place. You place it down nicely and then seal it properly. So that's another thing you have to make sure. And the third thing is um, when you're drying it, making sure you put it in the right place. And um, making sure it doesn't get stuck to something else because it's quite sticky. So you leave it somewhere for 30 minutes and make sure... It's okay so that's the three things that um, I did I have to look out for the next time I do this and I was very conscious about it when I was doing this hair so um another thing I'm so happy this hair didn't have any um any beers because that helped so much because if it did the beers would get stuck to the weft and that's just another problem so let me just show you the weft close up so that's how the weft looks and it has like this whitish whitish and um, so that's how the weft look so it has this kind of whitish and um, clear color to it but I think later on the color is gonna fade out so that's the color of the weft there so yeah 
hyperventilated and it becomes hard becomes hard and it stays steady and me doing this reduces the shedding and any anything that's gonna have any shedding or breaking of the hair this helps reduce it so that's the reason I did this because I wanted my hair to last longer so this is the hair here and yeah I hope you guys can see the weft properly just wanted to show you guys how it looks like and no one is gonna see that because it's in your hair so it's gonna be all good so so that's the hair all done as you guys can see finished doing three of my weave of my um, Peruvian virgin human hair so I finished doing all the wefts and I'm gonna still let it dry for a while so it can really get there so anyway thank you guys for watching my video and I'll see you guys in the next video bye